We live in one of the most beautiful places in the world. Where can you ski, golf, and sail on the same day? Not too many places. And uh, in the Fraser Valley, we are blessed uh, with mountains, an incredible river system, uh, natural parks, hiking. And this course is about understanding where you live. Uh, my greatest hope for my students is that when they complete BC First Peoples 12, they know where they live. But with and in that conversation, we need to consider a whole bunch of different things. Not just what it means to own a home uh, or develop land or to visit the mall or to have a good infrastructure, but we have to understand our past, the history, and the fact that many, many people have relied on what is in the Fraser Valley for a very, very long time. And so ultimately, the two words that I like to use to describe this course are land and covenant. And so what does it mean to participate in a landscape and have a covenant, an agreement, a contract, a promise? Uh, what does that look like for us today as Westerners, as consumers, uh, as a lot of middle-class people with great jobs and opportunities? Uh, and what does that look like for people in the past, like the First Nations of the Fraser Valley, the Matsqui, the Semiamu, the Keitsi, the Kwantlen, who have been in this part of the world for thousands of years? How do they see the land? Uh, what is their covenants, their agreements with the land? And as these two often different perspectives collide, we have to understand uh, the complexity of where we live. Uh, why do we have reserves for First Nations? Why is there so much controversy over the Trans Mountain Pipeline? Uh, what do we do? Um, with the cultures that have been displaced. Uh, what does it mean to own land versus steward land? So these are important questions that uh, we want to wrestle with in this course. Uh, we want to go deep into the layers and we want to go wide uh, in a timeline of both the past, uh, the present and the future. We want to look at economics, we want to look at history, educational opportunities, um, land developments, biology. We wanna look at a wide variety of different variables and contributing factors in this course to understand it better. But what makes Langley Christian a little bit more unique when it offers this course is a biblical perspective. Because in the Old Testament, uh, we also see in that ancient culture um, a very clear presentation of land and covenant. The story of Abraham uh, and his descendants are part of a promise to receive land. And Abraham is taken into a covenant in the book of Genesis. And that whole story of land and covenant and his family plays out with the Hebrew people who become the nation of Israel. And so from a biblical perspective, this conversation is extremely important, not only for understanding land and covenant, but for understanding the entire Bible and the idea of restoration, forgiveness, stewardship, being made in the image of God, uh, being called to uh, be co-creators and to steward and sustain the land that, that has been created. And so at Langley Christian School, we are after the big picture. We are after a deep understanding of uh, what it means to be human, what it means to live here, to live well, to live faithfully, not just as citizens of Langley, um, but as followers of Jesus.